page number 26 question number 3 write each decimal as a fraction here we have to convert this decimal into fraction numbers means numerator and denominator and after com converting them into fraction we have to convert them into simplest form so number 1 is 0 0.2 we have to take only 10, 100 or 1000 according to the numbers. So we have two numbers only. It means we can take 10. Now 2 upon 10 is the simple fraction form. Now we have to convert it into simplest form. 2 ones are 2, 2 fives are 10. Again 50 and the total numbers are 1, 2, 3, 100. 50 ones are 50, 52 is 100. 9, 1, 2, 3, 100. We cannot cut both of them. So we just have to write it as an answer. Now we have 1.25. We take this one as a whole number on the separate side. And then 2500. Because we have 1, 2, 3. 3 digits. 25 is a 25. 25 4 is a 100. And the whole number will remain same. Page number 27. Number E. 3.20. 3 is the whole number. 20. And then 100. 21 is a 20, 25 is a 100. 5.05, 5. 5 is the whole, 5 and 100 because we have 1, 2, 3, 3 digits. 5 ones are 5, 520 is 100. And then we have 1.23, 1 is the whole number, 23 and 100. 1, 2, 3, that's why we take 100. And we cannot cut these numbers, so this is the simplest form of the decimal 2.68 268 and divided by 100 because again we have three numbers so two whole number will remain same here we have four ones are four remaining two here four seven the 28 four twos are eight four fives are 20 so this is the explanation of page number 26 and 27